Hello everyone, welcome to Home Cooking with me Hema Subramanian. I'm sure many of you would have heard about salted caramel or salted caramel sauce and you're probably wondering how do you make this at home, it must be very difficult but today I'm going to share a very easy and perfect recipe that you can make at home for salted caramel and you can bottle it and enjoy it for all your desserts. So why wait, let's get started and check out the recipe. For the salted caramel sauce, take a heavy bottom saucepan, add 1 cup of granulated sugar, keeping the flame on medium, continue heating the sugar until it gradually melts. Just gently mix it every 30 seconds. So once the sugar is completely dissolved, reduce the flame to a low and wait till you get that rich lovely caramel colour because you don't want to burn the sugar syrup. So this can burn very quickly so you have to be very careful. So now you can see it's got a lovely honey colour. So once it turns to a lovely light brown colour, you can turn off the stove. Remove it from the heat, keep it aside. So the colour continues to change even after removing from the heat. Add the softened butter immediately as soon as you remove the saucepan from the stove. This has to be done very very quickly. You do not want to rest the sugar syrup otherwise it can get hard. So once the butter is completely melted, add in half cup of fresh cream. Now add half teaspoon of salt. So your salted caramel sauce is done. It will cool gradually, you can cool it in room temperature. So you can see the caramel sauce is thickened beautifully. You can see the rich colour, it's amazing. It smells incredible. If you want to keep it for longer, you can bottle it and store it in the refrigerator. And uh, if you want to reheat it, you can always reheat it in the microwave or on the stove top to get the liquid consistency. See now I have made a batch earlier and I have refrigerated it, you can see it's become nice and thick. So once I leave it at room temperature and before I use it, I can just heat it slightly and it will come back to a nice liquid consistency. Now this tastes wonderful, it goes very well with any desserts, ice creams, popcorn or even uh, brownies, cakes, you can top it for anything. This is a wonderful recipe, do try this and enjoy your desserts. Wow, that caramel sauce looks incredible with that lovely rich caramel colour. Now make sure you follow all the steps correctly to get the perfect caramel sauce. Now you can bottle it, refrigerate it up to a month and you can enjoy it. So do try the recipe, share it with your family and friends and enjoy. <laughs>